Welcome back. We are here looking at the energy market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Wednesday, July 27, 2022. If you like the support channel, you're going to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our newest videos, and all my trades and portfolio are available in the link down below. And our new technical analysis of the cryptocurrency market is also available on my YouTube profile and on Patreon. The link is down below. So let's start by looking at the uh, WTI oil. And as you can see, we did rally quite nicely in the beginning of the session um, or basically the European session. And uh, we went near $100 per barrel and then just completely collapsed down towards the, um, the 200 moving average. So we still have this bearish channel that we are in at this current stage. The lows being right here. So breaking the 200 moving average, that could lead this market to drop very significantly to the downside. We tested the upper part, which is roughly at the 200, the 20 simple moving average. And at this current stage, if we drop, then we may see this market go towards uh, 85, give or take. So drop towards the bottom of this channel and then probably just continue. After that, we this market should be significantly oversold. So it would make sense that we drop rally and then just continue uh, back and forward in, the, with, in this market. Um, the world economy is technically slowing down, um, so demand destruction will occur, uh, even though supply is um, uh, is basically short at this point, then if people don't need oil and factories are going to produce less, then yes, demand destruction will basically uh, make prices drop off a, off a cliff. As they did back in, for example, if you look at the financial crisis this is basically what happened we had a massive rally up towards 147 dollars and then we dropped all the way down towards 33 dollars within half a year this was basically what happened in back in in 2014 also towards the lows and a drop of more than uh, more than 50 percent and also were in 2020 when the beginning of the coronavirus so so um Recessions, economic downturns, they really have a drag on, on oil prices and energy prices in general. So so technically oil is still the last bash in standing. Um, everything else has dropped significantly um, except for energy. So if you look at technical indicators, we can see that MACD is still flat in negative territory. Stochastic is becoming bearish and RSI is bearish as well. So let's look at natural gas and natural gas is looking a horrible today. So of course we had this massive spike uh, up towards the $9.4. And the reason for this is because, um, well, Russia is basically cutting a supply to Europe. And um, that of course is a bad news and uh, technically good news for the price of uh, natural gas as, um, Traders expect European to go to United States to buy natural gas, even though that is kind of uh, impossible at the point because infrastructure is just not there for uh, the United States to deliver that much uh, natural gas to Europe. So this is looking like a really nasty sh shooting star and this market just got significantly overstretched. This is also due to the heat wave that is occurring um, in both in the United States and also in Europe. And uh, at this current stage, it looks like we have a market that is about to drop back towards the 200 moving average. So that is from 9.4 all the way down uh, towards the 5.8 at this current stage. So it is to be seen uh, whether or not it's going to be that drastic, but there's no reason for uh, this massive move. Um, speculation especially from from russia that is or news from russia is making this market completely pop to the upside um, if you look at technical indicators we can see the macd is still bullish stochastic is becoming bearish and rsi is on the edge of being over uh, bought but still it's not bearish it's bullish still so hope you find this helpful you always push up and subscribe and hit the like button bell button to see our new videos good luck and thank you very much